Hi, today we're going to look at adding uh, a new page to our site. So first of all we're going to log in. So I've put in my UTAS credentials and my password and I'm going to go log in. Okay, so here we are on the admin dashboard again. Now I want to go into my site. So I'm going to go into Sarah Mitchell scrapbook and click on there on the pen. Okay, so now I'm in my site and I know I'm in my site because the um, all the the site um, information has come down here. So I've got my site info that I could go into and change um, the information like the name of the site. Pages, and that's where I want to go now. So I'm going to click on Pages. Okay, so by default you get a welcome page but I want to add my own new page now. So I'm going to go up here and add new page. And the title of my new page is background Okay, so my new page is called Background to the Collection. And I'm going to now, oh, I want to add it to my navigation. So click that and then click Add. Okay, so now I've got my new page. Now I'm in the page edit screen. So this is where I actually build the page. So over here we've got all the the blocks we can add to our page. Now uh, mostly you'll be using HTML because that's text. Um, you might be adding media, that would be an item. Uh, you might be also um, using item showcase to add um, a number of items as well. But we'll look at each of those separately. But basically to add a new block, you just click and it adds. And then you start entering the text. Um, source gives you the HTML. So you can always go back in and change that if you wanted to. Um, links here. This is where you actually choose your formats. So normal paragraph format is normal. And with the headings, you can choose a heading. So heading one, heading two, heading three, he heading four. Now for accessibility, you want to um, do your headings in descending order. So like heading one, then for a subheading, it would be heading two. And that's just to let people know um, who have accessibility issues um, what they then they can understand the, f the layout of the page. Over here you can also use um, different styles. Now we don't really suggest you use those because you don't want to over format the um, your page. Okay, you want to be following the basic um, UTAS marketing web um, editorial guidelines and there's a link to those guidelines on the um, add, pay, add content library guide page. Okay, so that's a basic understanding of the pa adding a page and the page edit screen. And always press save. Thank you.